Hi guys, welcome to the unboxing and quick review of this Dogu Bluetooth 5.0 wireless earbuds. They come with IPX5 or of course some kind of waterproof and they have a 50 hour playtime in total. I mean with every charge the earbuds last for about 5 hours but we can charge them with the cradle about 10 times the cradle is really capable i mean it has a built-in 1000 milliampere battery which is definitely above average and the really really special thing here is they come in rose gold we can't see that is with the box here but we find that on the package as you can see s6a rose gold i'm going to listen to them i'm wearing them i'll let you know how music is i mean how good the quality of the speakers are how good wearing comfort is if they stay in place or fall out i'll let you know how good the microphone is uh, i will go I will definitely going to record and play here in this video so you can listen to the microphone sound so you will know if it's sufficient for you to make phone calls and I will test how easy they are to connect and everything so by the way they are around $50 at the moment so not too expensive not too cheap I think it's a good medium price range where you can expect some good quality and i think yeah it's i mean it's still time to buy nice gift for christmas um yeah especially this this uh, amazon prime it's definitely still uh, good to buy and get it right on time before Christmas and that could be a really nice thing so I'll have to cut that and open that and let you know what we get so this is how it looks when you open the box for the first time we get a small user manual I'm going to show you that really quickly as quick as possible hope you can see that it's a little bit more than yeah I'll put it down so I'm not shaking too much and you have time uh, yeah just go to the highest settings and yeah make sure you pause it for a while so you have plenty of time to read everything and i hope it's focusing nicely and yeah if you don't need that of course you can skip that part oh yeah i, I almost missed a larger part of it I think that's really important and the back side of the whole thing that's a really detailed instruction I hope it's not too difficult but usually this kind of earbuds are not really complicated I mean you have the cradle which you charge and then you charge the earbuds in the cradle and um, yeah connecting via Bluetooth 5.0 usually is pretty easy here you have the specs and some kind of warranty and maybe even contact information haven't seen that but yeah at least we have now the full instructions here if you uh, can't find it i mean maybe you need that to make a buy decision or you have bought it and lost your manual it's always good to have such a thing on hand here we get the cable charging cable i guess it's micro usb can't that see from here yeah that's micro usb but nice white we get the ear tips i guess there are three different sizes probably the largest and smallest are still here and medium size is probably already on and yeah this is a really nice box I don't know why they didn't do the this really nice rose gold outside but at least we have it here so you could actually yeah take it out and make this alone as a gift so it's a little bit hard to open maybe I do it from the wrong side yeah so it's easy here wow look at this isn't that the beauty wow 
That's crazy. I mean, I haven't seen something like that. That would be really nice as a gift for your wife, spouse, girlfriend, daughter, whatsoever. I mean, that's a cool thing. And yeah, they have, they come even with these nice hooks. I mean, yeah, some people prefer it without, but I can def definitely tell you um, they definitely will uh, hold. I mean, it stay better in place and the risk to lose them or they just, uh, yeah, that they drop uh, during the, uh, when they go to exercise or uh, in the gym or whatsoever, the chance that they drop is much lower. So that's a good thing here. Let's take them out. The really nice thing is that everything is really some kind of rose gold. And as you can see, that's probably the medium size, I would say, the thing which is already on. And yeah, so it's also important to see how good they connect. Usually these pins are protected here. So you have, before you can use them, you have to remove these plastic stickers here on both of the earpieces shouldn't be a problem usually but behind the camera it's a little bit difficult to see as you can see it's these pins were totally protected which is a good thing so they are not discharging or whatsoever in here and let's see how easy they connect yeah I had to push this one a little bit down but at least we can see that they make contact now with the red light obviously they are charging now probably they are re already fully charged so they turn off and we have this protection here really really nice box and here's just one plug here for the micro USB there's nothing else this rubber feeds here so I'm here on the Bluetooth settings on my phone and I take them out. They are really nice protected here, the box, but uh, no problem. So I think when I am not wrong, you can just take them out of this box. They are a little bit uh, hidden here, so I have to take them out, grab them like this. And they should connect to each other. Um, yeah, I don't know when they are finished connecting, but when they are connected, I think, uh, yeah, if I'm not wrong, as soon as they are connected to each other, it should be possible to connect them here also to my mobile phone. I'll do a refresh here. It should be at the end the S6A. So according to the instructions, you have two ways how to connect. Either you, I mean, the first thing is to remove this plastic, put it back in the cradle, then take it out and they go automatic in this pairing mode where they pair to each other. It takes up to two minutes and when they stop flashing alternately red and blue, they should appear here on the Bluetooth settings and that happened with this thing yeah, in this situation here. The second possibility is uh, when you want, don't want to take them back into the cradle, you can push the buttons here, the MFD buttons for about five seconds and release the buttons and then they go into pairing mode. So it looks like they are paired now, they are not flashing anymore. And so I try to connect them to my phone here. Let's see what kind of require, uh, yeah, what kind of permissions they ask. So it takes a little bit of time. So for some reason it didn't work for the first time, so I had to hold for five seconds. Now both set pairing. For some reason, just the one here is blanking red blue again it says pair with s6a allow access to your contacts and call history and now have you seen that there was a light on both of them 
and I think it, they are connected here. They are saying, oops, yeah. Um, where do we have it here? Connect, yeah, here. Connected battery 100% and active. So I'm going to listen now to the sound and try everything and let you know how this works and uh, I'm going to play you the uh, footage of the microphone recording as well. So I'm back with all the test results and I have to say that it was the one of the most surprising earbuds test at all of all of them. I When I saw this set I thought yeah okay it is looking nice I mean we have the rose gold but probably the best feature of the thing will be the rose gold and everything else is just like uh, working as normal but uh, the test exceeded uh, my expectations by far I can really tell you by far I mean I really didn't expect that that they are not only looking good but also working really really amazing I mean this this sound experience I've been listening to, to some kind of YouTube channel with deep bass test so this is the one ultra deep bass uh, test 18 million views and you have to promise me when you buy these things you have to listen to this thing it will blow off your head whatsoever <laughs> it's crazy I mean that's definitely the best uh, bass sound which I have ever heard from in-ear head, uh, yeah, headset or earpieces or whatsoever. Uh, that's really, really crazy. I really didn't expect that. And they are really comfortable. I didn't have to really push them deep inside some of the earpieces from other brands. You have to push them really deep inside to hear some kind of deep bass not with this ones or oh, they were just perfectly sitting i don't know wh why but uh, i mean that was the best deep bass uh, sound experience which i've ever had with this ones i can't tell you why but it's amazing it was absolutely incredible and the fit is great also here these hooks they are perfect. I mean, they go from to the front and somehow they are really, really tight. They, yeah, I uh, did a lot of things like shaking with my head and front and back and side and left, right, up and down and they didn't move a bit. So I think if somebody is going a lot to a gym, doing a lot of exercises, this thing is really, really amazing. And they all the other ones the other manufacturers should do this thing too because it's a really nice extra hold the all the other ear uh, pieces they are mostly struggling i mean they stay in place more or less uh, until you start sweating and usually when you start sweating then they fall out and here you have this extra uh, protection which is really really amazing and i tried the microphone as far as i know both of them have the microphone and you can use them uh, single ones like if you really want to have them on 24 hours you can charge one and work with this one then charge this one work with this one of course you don't have stereo but you can still make phone calls that's the good thing and the microphone was really amazing too that's uh, yeah that was one of the best microphone uh, recording experience which I've ever had as well from in-ear ear tips I mean yeah we have to uh, be aware of the microphone is not in front of your head it's uh, yeah close to your ears and a lot of these headphones are struggling with a good microphone quality and these ones are really good i mean these are in the definitely top 10 percent probably at least at this price level definitely uh, no problem and i'm going to show you that microphone test now to access your account please enter your pin followed by the pound key test one two three four five test 
one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, hope you have been able to hear that uh, from my side. It was really way above average, definitely. And uh, yeah, the ear tips you can remove. It's not sh such a problem, but they sit, sit quite tight. As you can see, you're not going to lose them instantly. So they're really good. Of course, it takes a little bit longer to replace them, but uh, when they sit really good, then you don't have to fear that anything happens with them that's the good thing another great experience was regarding the functions of the mfd you have when you are using both of them same time you have different functions with the left one and the right one like you have there's always a one click here one click here double click here double click here or long press here and here there are uh, all these six different functions now it closed yeah we have it here you can see these six different functions and they worked pretty well the only thing is i think they mixed up the volume increase and decrease i think the volume up was on the right side i'm pretty sure at least for me it worked like this and the good thing is these buttons here they work pretty well. They have an absolutely perfect pressure point. I have been struggling with a lot of them. Some have too hard pressure point. With some uh, of them you can't feel even where the button is. Some have these silly touch buttons where you, yeah, when you just uh, touch your ears, you will change something, change the track, change the volume, change, maybe make a phone call whatsoever. Here, it's not too hard to push, but it's also uh, not really uh, too easy that you just push it accidentally. So it's it's absolutely perfect here. They look perfect. I mean, what can I tell you apart from that? Yeah, by the way, also here the R and L from for left and right are easy, very easy to read. Some of the earbuds are really hard to read. I mean, of course, you have same thing again here, R and L, and since they are not the same, I mean, it's not uh, possible to mix them actually. So, yeah, it's a good thing. Here they are a little bit shaky. They are, this is not a strong magnet, I mean, but you, when you push them inside the cradle, you will see the red light and obviously yeah when the light goes off i guess it's fully charged already i haven't read about that but i'm just guessing i'm not going into all the functions here with pairing resetting repairing whatsoever but my impression was really really great uh, i would not definitely not hesitate to uh, make this as a gift for uh, girlfriend, wife, spouse, daughter, whatsoever. They are amazing and they look amazing. And yeah, I think that's it for now. And as always, I'll put down the link to the listing on Amazon into the description below so you can check it out and order it right from there if you like it. I hope I have been able to help you a little bit with that. If you have any questions or comments, just write to the comment section below. I'm always happy to talk about these things. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.